Oh my gosh, I really enjoyed this tonight. Thank you. I love those tacos with extra onions. <laughs> yeah, I know this. Oh, with the tequila, you know, tacos and tequila, so much fun. Yeah. I'm excited to kick my boots off. <laughs> yeah, come on. Yeah, we made it. Join me inside. Thank you for walking me up. Well, good night. Ooh. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, I just gotta go. But I thought you had a nice time. I mean, I, I did, you know, it's just... Uh... Well, what's the problem? If I had a good time and you did too, let's take it up or not. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think that's a good idea. Is there something wrong with me? Well, is there? It's the onions, okay? <laughs> you ate onions tonight. You won't kiss me because I had onions at dinner? I could go brush my teeth if it's that big of a deal to you. It's not like that. Like, I'm definitely allergic to onions, okay? Like, I, I really shouldn't have been around them tonight. Like, you know, one force move and I'm dead. Why didn't you say anything? Nina, I tried. Wow, okay. I just won't eat onions around you. Yeah, um, I'm trying to look for a woman that doesn't eat onions at all. Like, I don't want her to one day, you know, eat onions one night and come back home, kiss me, and then I just fall over and die. I can't believe we're having this conversation right now. Like, you're still a great catch, and um, you're a pretty girl. Oh. Are you giving me the pre-breakup? The what? The breakup before the breakup? The breakup before it even gets started? Uh, I guess so. I'm the one that normally does that. Okay, well, it's gonna be cool. Not really. I've never been rejected before. So, I'm going to give you the pre-pre-breakup. The pre-pre what? It's where we pretend this date never happened and I pretend to have rejected your advances. Now please leave so I can forget you ever existed. Ugh, not gonna work. I can't believe this is happening. I, I don't know what to do. How many drinks did you have before the accident? Why does that matter? It matters because if you were completely intoxicated, we could plead manslaughter. I'm just trying to think about you right now. Plead? I don't want to plead to anything. I just want this to go away. You kill somebody, Nick. That doesn't just go away. What did you do right after you hit him? I called you. I didn't know what else to do. Did you even check to see if she was alive? Of course she's dead. I hit her going 50. I understand that, but did you check her pulse? Why does that matter? We have to figure out what we're going to do. We? We. <laughs> I'm trying to help you right now, but you got to give me something in the process. So once again, did you check to see if she was still alive? Okay. So there's a chance she could be. Take me to where she's at. We can call an ambulance or 911. That way it doesn't look like you just panicked and left the fucking thing. I can't do that. Why not? I, I don't know where it is. Damn it, Nick. Think for a minute. We don't have to go out there. What are you talking about? She's in my trunk. She's what? I don't know what else to do. Where the fuck is your car? Let's go.